I've been in this profession for the last about 14 years. I started off as a publisher and then I moved to PR. So while I was working in PR in an agency supporting various brands, I kind of fell in love with marketing. Recently, say maybe two, three years ago, I added customer experience in that. So I have been handling both marketing PR and customer experience in the corporates that I've worked for. While you cannot measure success, but saying this is how successful I've been, I think I have really enjoyed the roles that I have served and I've been able to transform the different roles that I have been in. My ideal working environment, an environment that um, encourages innovation. And I must say, especially where I work right now, it's a very big agenda. I read both uh, fiction and non-fiction books. Currently, I'm on a, a, a fiction book called The Girl with the Louding Voice by Abby Dyer. And the reason I like that book um, is because it kind of speaks to the younger me. I think the biggest thing I have done in my life is learning to unlearn. Take every day as a new experience and tell myself that I still don't know it yet and therefore opening myself up to learning everything. The next two years, I do not want to look at position as the achievement. I have a strategy that I have put, developed for the next three years for the company that I currently work for, Minet. And my success is that I see that strategy implemented 100%. Looking at my life, the choices that I have made in terms of courses and career journey, I don't think I would want to do it differently. And I don't think there would be an opportunity to do it differently. I think it has been the right way. PR needs to be understood mostly by the practitioners and then by the people who interact with it. The job of, job of a PR practitioner is not to make the company look good. The job of a PR practitioner is to advise the company on how they can engage their stakeholders to achieve whatever it is that they want to achieve. If people understood PR that way, there will be respect, but we, we have to take on the role of the girl with the louding voice if I am to refer to the book that I read. You have to make your voice heard, no matter the situation.